Okay, this is what uh, is commonly referred to as a solenoid engine, uh, even though it's not a, a a traditional solenoid because I'm using magnets inside this coil here. But the solenoid engines, and there's a ton of them on YouTube. If you look up a uh, solenoid engine, um, all different kinds, V8, six cylinder, four cylinder, one cylinder, all different kinds. But this is a a simple one cylinder. Um, solenoid type of engine where the magnet or the um, iron or steel rod goes in and out of the coil as the coils energizes uh, on a real solenoid it sucks the thing in there and uh, causes the motion and then hooked through a bell crank system to a flywheel on this and this is why it's called an engine is the solenoid runs this thing into rotary motion and all I've got here is a coil of 30 gauge wire on a sewing machine bobbin and it goes through a simple circuit where the energy comes into the shaft and then there's a simple make and break here at the tip of the crankshaft and that causes the uh, coil to be energized which sucks the magnets in and around and around we go. Now, the only reason I did it this way was the magnets came out too far and they were falling down, so I put this extra bobbin on there just to hold the magnets. And then after I got this thing all done, I thought, well, you know what? If I wind that with fine wire, now I've got a motor generator. So I might see what happens there. If I, if I connect them together, of course, i got a much more powerful electromagnet that will draw less, less juice. But let's see if I can get this to go here. And there's your solenoid engine. And it's all a spin-off of this air engine project that I just got through doing and 3D printed. And this is this uh, solenoid engine. And um, anyway, very interesting. I'm going to give a link to a very, very interesting uh, solenoid engine built by Peter who is one of my heroes here on YouTube. He builds little airplanes and all kinds of things but he did a four cylinder version of this using 3D printing and uh, I was really impressed on how he incorporated his 3D printing into a four cylinder um, solenoid engine that he actually powered a little boat with. So anyway that's where I'm at with this um, little project um, and um, so far it's been pretty fun. Thanks for watching.